Welcome everybody to my YouTube channel. I'm Rebecca Vernon and I'm going to do a plus size try on haul today. I'm actually, uh, we're planning my grandson's christening. Um, he's actually just over one, which we wouldn't have actually planned on having his christening, I don't think, when he was quite as old as he was. We have a lovely christening gown um, that's been in the family. Um, well, it's been in, it, it was made for my daughter's uh, christening and she's now 26 and she's the one whose baby it is um, and um, it would have been really lovely for him to have um, been christened in the christening robe that she wore unfortunately um, that's not going to be possible because he's now one and uh, this is what Covid's done so never mind so I'm going to be choosing something to wear hopefully out of this little haul. Um, it's a sales haul from Next, um, which uh, I, I'm always ordering from Next because I have one of those special delivery um, bargain slots on it. So basically you pay, I think it's £20 for the year and you can order as many times as you like, um, as opposed to paying three ninety five for each order. So it, it's, it's a great way of doing it. Um, and the way I see it is, if you went out shopping somewhere, well, you haven't been able to do that, but in normal circumstances, if you went out shopping somewhere, you'd go for lunch, you'd pay for your parking, before you know it, you've spent 20 pounds, so I'd only have to do that once, and then, um, and then, yeah, so, uh, we've, we've got four dresses to try on, so hopefully we can find something that's suitable in this lot, and, uh, so yeah, let's get let's get on with the with the haul and uh, see what we think. Um, let's hope they fit. Okay, so let's give it a try. Okay, so this is the first one. Oh, gosh, this is rather wide. This is a French Connection shirt dress. Um, it's it's very wide actually. Gosh, you couldn't get in this if you were a lot bigger. Um, so it's got waist I guess it's supposed to be quite loose I suppose that must be the design of it um, so it's got a tie so you can easily tie that in a bow I think what I'm going to do is just move the camera further back just a second so okay let me just see so it's got little ties on the sleeve now whether they'll dry me back But I actually do. <laughs> These probably will drive me mad. I'm sure they look very pretty, but I think I'll, I think what I'd probably have to do is just put a catch stitch in them so that they stay fastened up because this sort of thing. The last thing you want when you're eating is it falling in your glass of wine or your soup or whatever. Um, so I'd probably have to stitch those shut. Right, so, so they tie at the wrist, which is great for if you've got perhaps a little wider arm there. Or some people, you know, might like to pull them up a bit further. Maybe you want to put them above your elbow and just let it blouse over. Um, I like the pattern on it. That's nice. Um, red and white, red and white floral. Um, this one is a cheeky London dress. I've always wanted one of these actually, because uh, so they always look really pretty and when I come out to all the people's dresses, um, they always say, hey, that's a really nice dress, where did you come back from? Oh, how do you think she's too lovely? In fact, my beautician, she's always buying from there. I'm going to let a secret out now, she's going to kill me. Um, and uh, yeah, she always has some really lovely dresses for weddings and things like that, Christmas and that. So yeah, I really like I really like those dresses. So this is a Chi Chi London dress. I don't know how much it should have been at the start with, but uh, it's actually reduced to 21 pounds. I absolutely love it. It's got um, a cream sort of silky lining and then a chewel layer over the top. Embroidery with navy and blues and creams in it. And then you can see it's got no lining 
in the sleeve, so you can just see your skin there, um, and it's all lined up the top. So you've got a nice deep V here with lovely, really, really pretty um, embroidery here, embroidered trim there, which is really pretty. And then it goes down here and around on the waist, so that's really nice. Um, and then you can see the embroidery there on the sleeve. There. I'll look better with a little bit of tap. Um, and I did try it on before and thought it was a little needed a little lift on the shoulder, but now I've managed to get somebody to fasten it up for me. It actually doesn't feel as bad. It does feel like it's there's a possibility it's gonna fall off my shoulders, but I don't suppose it is actually because it does fit. Probably what I'll do is get some is put some little modesty loops in with little press studs on so it'll hold on my bra. So it's also got, let me just move my hair out of the way, it's got a V-back too, so that's very pretty. Yeah, so I, I love, I'm in love with this dress, absolutely in love with it. So I think I'll have to keep this one, and I think I'll probably have to keep it to do the A-bomb. These are really lovely. Obviously, I've only got one christening to go to, but I have got a wedding to go to as well. So, and I could wear the blue shoes again with this. Could I wear those? Yeah, I think I can get away with that. Um, or I have got some little navy. I've got some navy ones as well. Navy people. Oh, leather. Maybe that looks a little bit heavy, perhaps. Um, I don't mind to have in the wardrobe got some little, a little sandaly with a little strappy sandal that I, they bought these in Paris when we went to Paris once. Um, got those little sandals with a little two strap with um, beaded embroidered flowers on. So they're really pretty. I could wear those. Maybe I've got, I might have some other little sandals I could wear with them if I wanted a little sandal with it. Could dress it down or dress it up but I think it's probably more like to dress it up so yeah I really love this really feel nice in it so it'll just be a decision now which one do I wear for the christening I think it's either got to be this one or this one and I know they're very 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 similar this one or this one they're very similar which one? Um, I love the red one too, the plain red, but that's definitely going to be too hot in July, she says. Hopefully. <laughs> Let's hope it's going to be too hot. So yeah, I really love this. Yeah, yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous. The dress, not me. Um, <laughs> right, so anyway. Thank you for joining and I know it's been a long time since I've done a clothing haul but I'm hopeful. I haven't really bought as many things to be fair and um, not that I buy everything on these hauls because I've just ordered lots to try on um, but I'm hopeful that some of these events that we had cancelled last year will all be able to go ahead this year even if they are perhaps slightly smaller because people have chosen to do it that way or um, and perhaps they're still feeling a little nervous or you know maybe they're going ahead as planned um, if they're later in the year so hopefully we can all have a lovely time and have some nice events to go to so um, there are some bargains out there so if you've got a